I planted a large flower bed with Eleanor Tabor Indian Hawthorns about three years ago. A couple of the plants made very few flowers and none of them ever bloomed after that. I also planted some Fraser red tip fatinias in another bed. They have never bloomed either. Why aren't my Indian Hawthorns or fatinias blooming? And this is from Ms. Barbara in Portland, Tennessee. So the Indian Hawthorns nor the fatinia are blooming. And I know what comes to your mind when plants don't bloom. Right. There's too much shade. Why be too much shade? Yeah. Plants that bloom, they need lots of energy from light. And if they're not getting enough, mm -hmm. then they're not going to produce blooms. All right. And of course, you know, we don't know conditions, but no. I'm just thinking if they're not blooming, Mr. D is. Well, it sounds like to me, and you've got two different species that have the same problem. Right. Same problem. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's right. Uh, and, and I will say this. Uh, the red tip for tinnias, mm -hmm. I don't know if that's the best choice though because of the entomosporium leaf spot. Right. And of course you're going to get, have more of those leaf spots in what, the shady, shady conditions. Areas, yes. Right. Where the, the water can't get off the leaves and it doesn't dry up soon enough. And you know, they're gonna, she's going to, if that's true, then the same thing is going to happen with the hawthorns because they ah. tend to have leaf spot diseases too. And in the shade, it's going to be worse. Right. Right. Oh. They also have the, the shot hole, you know, mm -hmm. disease as well. But yeah, under those conditions, they really don't have it. It's going to be worse. We hope you loved the video. We would love for you to ask more questions. Be sure to leave those questions in your comments.